Okay, so now I'm going to walk you through the JV sequence that I use for PLF4. So these are, the sequence was done completely via email, and these are the emails that I sent out to my partners. Now there are 39 emails, it's a lot of email, and I go overboard. Um, we do really, really well with our JV promotions, and we go absolutely overboard. So what you're seeing is about as intense as it gets. No one else really does it like we do. We get great results. Our partners are used to getting a lot of emails. They're used to going through a lot of launches. You know, if you're in a market where you don't have a lot of JVs that have been really trained to do really well on a lot of launches, they might get overwhelmed by these number of emails. But so I'm just showing you one end of the spectrum, the most intense end of the spectrum. But you're going to see how, you know, the, 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 a lot of the triggers that we use in our pre-launch to our prospects, I use in my my sequence to my partners. So again, this sequence is done purely via email. We didn't use any videos or anything. Of course, there's a lot of phone calls and individual emails and text messages going out to our top partners, but this is what we sent out to all of our partners, and this is what we really use to drive the competition um, among our partners. So this is the first one, and, and I will give you a copy of all these emails, so if, you, if, you have, if they're sm too small for you to read, I'm just I'm doing my best to get them to fit on the screen. If they're too small to read, you can read all of them. Um, and also, I'm not going to go line by line through all 39 of these emails. I'm going to skip through them pretty quickly. But I started off, and this first email went out on June 3rd. So this was uh, June 3rd, a full three months before our launch was to start. And that's because in my market, these la the launches tend to get scheduled out pretty far in advance, and all the partners have very busy calendars, promotional calendars, so I wanted to sort of mark those dates as far ahead as I could. So we sent this out three full months, you know, on June 3rd, and you can see it's just a save the date message. Um, and But you can see even in that second paragraph, I start off with the authority. You know, after nine consecutive seven-figure launches, this is going to be the best launch yet. Just wait until you see what I've up my sleeve. So I'm building a little bit of anticipation and curiosity, but I'm also massive authority with those nine consecutive launches. And then if you look down like in that PS section, if you've promoted me for me for me in the past, you know my stuff converts like crazy every single time. And I would love to have you on board. Um, and then Further down the last PPS, if you know of anyone else who's thinking of launching around those dates, do them a favor and warn them to move their dates. Pretty much everyone in the known universe will be on board and supporting us on those dates. Just saying. So obviously, I'm trying to make sure I get those dates to myself and I don't overlap with any other people in the market. And, you know, that's just pure authority. This, is, this, this email is, all, is a save the date and it's a pure authority email. So then on July, about a month later, on July 1st, this is basically the exact same email for the most part. Um, it's just another save the date, trying to stay in front of my partners, trying to get, you know, just, just so that they don't, you know, so that they've carved out those dates. And also, you know, I'm trying to make sure that no one else does a launch at that si same time because if other people are doing a launch at that time, then they could be potentially diluting you know the partners for me you know they, if my partners are some pr supporting someone else they won't be supporting me so I'm just trying to mark off my space on the calendar then on August 4th about a month later so we did a June 3rd July 1st August 4th we came out with an again it's uh, it's a very similar well, it's a somewhat similar email to save the date, but this is the first time I tell them it's an all new product, PLF 4.0. It's the big reveal. First all new product launch formula since 2010. Biggest JV prizes ever. Nine consecutive million dollar launches. And, um, you know, just some more authority, but then also, you know, a little bit of a reason why here that it's all new and it's going to be a big launch. Then on August 16th, so this is about two weeks later. So now it's only about a, 
you know, August, we're only about a month out from the start of pre-launch, and so now I go from every month to every, uh, you know, every second week. And this is just another quick reminder to save the dates. And then on August 22nd, now we're getting close. I'm telling them, holy cow, we're getting close, getting close. We're starting on September 4th. And then now on August, or I'm sorry, September 1st, and this is just a few days out now. This is only three days out. So the urgency and the frequency um, increases. And now look at that subject line. It's $220,000 this Wednesday. And so I just tell them we're going to have the biggest launch prize we've ever offered before. And it's going to absolutely crush. So, And this will be our 10th consecutive million dollar plus launch. Okay, now we're basically emailing them pretty much every day, I think, at this point. Now it's, it's September 2nd, um, 12 reasons this launch will crush. So now I'm starting to, we're getting a little more creative. It's not the same old email. I give them 12 reasons why it's going to completely crush. And it starts off with this important header. Pre-launch starts Wednesday. That's in just two days. We start on Wednesday, September 4th. The thing is, is your affiliate partners and your JV partners are very, very busy. So that's why you try to be very, very explicit. It starts Wednesday. That's in just two days, Wednesday, September 4th. Um, and then now I know you get lots of hype-filled GAV emails almost every day. They tell you about promotions or launches that are just going to kill it. The only problem is that a lot of them don't actually kill it. Some of them just plain suck. And that's the truth. Like everyone is, hypes it up about how great their launch is going to be, but, you know, ours are great every single time. <laughs> they just are. I mean, I'm just saying they really are. So let's forget the hype. Here's 12 reasons this launch will crush. PLF is proven. I've personally done 14, I've done nine consecutive million or multi-million dollar launches for the PLF brand. Market loves it, I know how, and I know how to sell it. Number two, I've personally done 14 consecutive million or multi-million dollar launches. This isn't my first rodeo. So, you know, that includes the ones I've done for other people, part, for, uh, for clients. Um, to my knowledge, PLF is the highest selling internet marketing product of all time. I've all, sold over $20 million worth. PLF 4 is an all new version. PLF has been off the market for a full year. The market's hungry for it. And I just go on reason after reason after reason all the way through. Um, just, just sort of hitting all the possible objections why someone might not promote. Then on September 3rd, it uh, starts tomorrow, $4,000 leads, $100,000 sales. And this is where I tell them about a $4,000 prize in leads for the most leads for just one day. So this is what we call a sprint contest. It's a JV sprint contest. And a sprint contest is something I named it after, like, um, they do this in bicycle racing, like in the Tour de France. There's, there, w there's many races within a race in the Tour. So there's a race every single day, and then there's an overall race for all 21 or 22 stages. But then even within each day, there'll be little intermediate sprints where it'll be like the top of this mountain, or, or, or there'll be a sprint somewhere in the middle, you know, two or three sprints in the middle of the day, and those sprints you'll get points for and you'll also get money for. So I created that concept of sprint prizes within a launch for joint venture partners. So here, just on the first day, whoever drove the most leads gets, you know, there's $4,000 in prizes, $2,000 for first place, $1,000 for second, $500 for third, and $250 each for fourth and fifth. And then I tell them there's also a $100,000 first prize, prices go. So this email, the day before we start out uh, the pre-launch is all about the prizes. Then um, I send them email. This is on, the, on September 4th, the day the pre-launch goes live. And I sent this to them early in the morning before we actually went live, gave them you know, a synopsis of what this first video is all about so they could start working on their copy. And then we actually give them swipe copy down below. So this is copy they can cut and paste. Now the reality is most partners, especially your top partners, they are not going to cut and paste and send this out. But you want to give them this copy so they have something to work with. So they have some place to start their copy. Then we sent, and again, on September 4th, once the, the video actually went live, we sent them an email that told them it was live, gave them their link and a swipe copy. Then later that day, that afternoon, we tell them they're crushing it. We're, we've got a 60.2% opt-in rate. 
and we gave them uh, uh, basically an intermediary or an intermediate um, leaderboard for the, the the sprint contest. You can see we gave them a current leaderboard where we listed the top seven. And then um, let's see. This was sent on September fifth. This is basically talking about how the what a great day we had. We generated four thousand leads. One of the best of first days ever great opt-in rate comments are strong so this is just all all authority all good news then we gave the first the winners for that first leads contest and uh, so now we're giving out money you gotta love it then on the next day on September 6th we announced a new leads contest so this is going to be a sprint contest over a 48 hour period then here um, this is just uh, November or September 7th. This is an update on the leads contest. And here we go on September 8th, another update on the leads contest that's going to end this night. Then here we go to, um, so, so basically this was September 8th there on this one. And here we come out. September 9th and we've got a new video the video is going to go live we give them fresh copy we talk about what the video is going to be about then we come out with uh, video 2 is now live go ahead and mail here's your link here's your swipe copy then um, we come out video 2 went live this morning this is later in the afternoon this is September 9th um, this is a, the results from the video and also you'll see here we updated or I updated the winners for the leads contests so um, the interesting thing you see here is back here this is um, September 8th when the contest was ending the night of September 8th and then September 9th you know I basically tell them about this video this new video coming out uh, now the video is live. Now later that day, I basically, then I came back and said, wow, the video is going great. And we've got a bunch of opt-ins. And oh, by the way, here's the leaderboard. You know, so, or, or, or not the leaderboard, but here's the results. So in other words, you know, the thing is, is lots, of, there's lots going on. And early in the morning, I wanted to tell them about this new video. I didn't want to tell, I didn't want to take the time and tell them about who won. You know, they, you got to think these that, that your partners are very busy. And I only, I always think like there's really only about one thing I can really truly accomplish in each email. And in this email, I wanted to get them all amped up, uh, amped up about this second video. And here, I wanted to tell them that the video was live. So it wasn't until here that I actually told them about the results from that contest. Okay, moving forward, September 10th. Um, this is. Uh, how about all the great leads we got yesterday and now you know at this point I don't have a sprint contest to report on so I'm talking about that you know uh, about the now we're I'm starting to talk about the sales prizes the sales prize of a hundred thousand dollars and now I give the overall leaderboard so up to this point I've been given sprint contest updates now I give the overall leaderboard so I mean and this isn't like a rigid formula that you have to follow. I'm just sort of giving you some of the psychology here. There's only so much you can fit in in each update, but I want to be updating them every single day. So on this day, you know, like here, this was um, uh, on on the ninth when we released that that video. Okay, we're killing it, and the ninth we're killing it. Now the tenth. Okay, what do I have to talk about? Hmm. Well, we got a lot of leads yesterday. Okay, that's fine. We can talk about that. But now I'll give them the overall leaderboard. So I'm always looking for something to keep them interested. Now, this one is on September 11th. Another huge day. Video number three is coming out tomorrow. So that's the main thing I want to con you know, I want to tell them about at this point. You know, new video. The first the video came out on the 9th. On the 10th, you know, the main thing was it's going well. And the 11th, the main thing is, we got a new video tomorrow. New video tomorrow. So that's what this email is all about. Now, this one is um, also on September 11th. 
and I'm trying to get them amped up about this video release the next day because this I knew this video was going to go, do really really well this 22 page report and a full video I knew it was absolutely going to crush it so this is where I'm you know just trying to get them amped up about that now down below you say in, you see in the meantime here's the important dates product launch blueprint Thursday in November or September 12th open cart 916 close cart 920 so now I'm starting to try to keep that cart open and the cart closed in front of me because I don't want to forget about that okay now on September 12th the the video 3 is live go ahead and mail so it's very if you look at it the actual email is only a few words you know there it's almost all swipe copy it's the the full text is okay the plot product launch blueprint and video 3 is live it's time to mail I've got your link and swipe down below mail 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 this is the one that's going to make you cash when we open the cart next week here's your link boom very short email it's almost all swipe copy so here where I want them to take action it's just boom we're live mail now okay so now this one is on September 13th and the subject line is JV's 8,000 opt-ins yesterday so that's pretty darn powerful okay I lied it was only six seven thousand six hundred seventy two but it was still an amazing day conversion rate was fifty three point zero three percent one JV at a fifty eight percent rate with almost a thousand opt-ins we're over a thousand comments now so um, so this is just this is just authority boom mass authority right here okay now September 14th um, the blueprint is red hot 13,000 leads in 37 hours mass authority here now we open cart Monday from here on you're going to see me keep on talking about that open cart open cart open cart open cart um, then we go here September 15th <laughs> like I said w focus on the open cart you know the, what are the first words we open cart on Monday with a hundred thousand dollars on the line so it's you're gonna see me keep on hitting the open cart and this is me trying to stir up competition here um, I say we all this is um, <laughs> we're opening cart and this is shaping up to be a hundred percent cage match in five short days we'll know who the winner is so I thought I would give a quick preview of the big guns who are in it to win it here's the top five who told me they're planning on winning 100k and then um, the thing you have to understand is in this market in the market I'm in this teaching people how to build businesses online it's very competitive uh, like there's a lot or everyone in it is a very competitive person and um, you know there's a lot of people working together and great partnerships but also there's some serious competition and so here I'm just trying to spur the competition and do a little trash talking so I'm trying to set up who the folks are that are really say they are going to win I'm trying all the way through this I'm going to tr be trying to push the competition as much as possible because that really drives massive results and you can read through these and um, yeah like if you yeah just just go through them they're sort of humorous if you think about it um, okay <clears throat> now on September 15th JV's your launch link for tomorrow Monday let's keep it simple I've got your launch link link for you remember we open at 2 p.m. Eastern tomorrow that's Monday September 16th so I'm just trying to make this as clear as possible then uh, when we're lot we go live on September 16th and here it's we're live and here's your link and here's your swipe copy um, it's very very short and sweet then uh, later in that day on September 16th we opened a few minutes early today we're already rocking it in the first four hours we're at four hundred and seventeen thousand dollars in sales boom that is authority so love to come out with authority on these then on uh, the 17th the, the, the day after card open we give them the first leaderboard um, it's shaping up to something special we did almost 200,000 overnight and we're sitting at seven hundred thirty four thousand dollars right now from looking at all the data it looks like a two million dollar plus launch sweet okay so now the first leaderboard so it's all power and authority and we 
you know, I do the leaderboard, and this is where you see the, the trash talking start. You know, um, Brennan Bouchard, returning champ, starts strong, but he's looking vulnerable. He's got his experts event for the last two days of the launch, so he could be distracted at the finish line. So, um, you know, just doing a little trash talking. Holly Lyle, wow, homegrown peel-off owner is crushing it. Um, Mine Valley showing some value. And so all the way through here, just, just doing a little bit of, you know, trash talking and trying to spur people to get them moving. Now on the 18th, this is two days after we open cart, JV's $1 million, Sparta, something new to mail on. Okay, we just hit $1 million in book sales, and that was the quickest trip to $1 million in many years. Thank you. We could have done it without amazing partner support. Hitting $1 million this early in the launch means we're almost surely headed for at least $2 million, maybe more. That means there's a lot of commissions up for grabs. Um, so basically, this is just authority and reassuring them that there is a lot of, uh, a lot of commissions still at stake. Down here, we, I get, they, this is where I give them something new to mail on. If you look down, one, two, three, four, five, let's see, the fourth paragraph. Right now, I wanted to tell you about something new to mail on our all access page. This is the deal. We built one page with all our amazing pre launch videos on it, no opt in required. Um, so basically, I'm giving them a new piece to mail on. So if they've already mailed on the open cart, this is something new to mail on. Um, on the 18th, this is, so this is the, the again the 18th. That last one was the 18th. Now I'm sending him a second email on the 18th. Uh, so that last email is really about that. Um, is really about hitting a million dollars, and and that all access page. This one is about the leaderboard. So uh, big shakeups throughout the leaderboard this morning. Um, Brendan, Holly, Kenny, Vision. Again, we're starting to get into the trash talking a little bit. Um, if you look down, numbers tied for number seven is Eben. Um, I think it's clearly time to start questioning Eben's manhood. Uh, so you got to understand, Eben's a good friend of mine, and I understand what um, what can really push him. But uh, yeah, um, the <laughs> the I knew this would get him going. So tie for seven. And from here, you'll see me really start to give Eben a hard time because I expected him to be, you know, in the top two or three for sure. We're going to keep on going forward. This one is on the 19th, so this is the day before the close. First, lots of movement in the leaderboard. I'll have an update tomorrow morning, um, which surprises me that I would wait that. I don't think I actually waited another 24 hours. But second, we're closing on Friday. That means we're officially in the money time. So the whole thing about scarcity, there's scarcity for the JVs as well. So I'm hitting the scarcity, and also I'm telling them to start hitting the scarcity. And the, the th number three, the third paragraph, it's time to add to your bonus. Now it's time to start messaging the closing scarcity to your people. Now it's time to double or triple your sales. Here's your link. So again, a very short email. It's mostly all swipe copy down below. So, so the actual new copy here, new, you know, stuff I've writing them is very, very short. Okay, 9 19, the same day. This is the day before the close, 36 hours to go. And we give them a quick leaderboard. Um, and uh, yeah, and you can see them moving around. And Eben number seven needs a testosterone patch. <laughs> so now another leaderboard on the 19th. So this is again the day before lunch. So here we gave it, gave them a leaderboard on the 19th with 36 hours to go. Now it's late in the day with a little over 24 hours to go. So this is late in the day on the 19th, the day before the close, and they give them another leaderboard. Um, we're getting down to the wire just over 24 hours until we close cart, and the leaderboard battle is coming down to the wire. Nerves are frayed, bonuses are getting bigger, and the gloves are coming off, and the leaderboard is jumping around like Brendan after he drank a five-hour energy drink. <laughs> which to my knowledge he has only done once and I was there to witness it. It was pretty intense. Okay, so just trying to enjoy, uh, introduce some levity here and frankly I'm having a good time here. I mean most of these people on the, on the leaderboard are my friends so I love giving them a hard time. Here um, I put the leaderboard in and I actually put prizes in as well. So their prize, so Brendan 100k, Holly Lyle 40k, that's the second prize. 
Kenny at 15k, the third prize. And as you go through each one of them, I listed the potential prize, you know, the prize next to them. And uh, yeah, there we go. Shalene Johnson uh, moves up one Spartan Pride on the line. So uh, Shalene is uh, went to the same went to my alma mater, the, the Michigan State there, and their mascot is a Spartan. Spartans, so the Michigan State Spartans, so Spartan pride on the line there. Uh, Lisa Sasevich hitting it hard on Friday. Um, Jeff Johnson, three sales from being alone in fourth. Uh, Andy and Mike fighting their way up through the leaderboard. And uh, yeah, so then if you look further down, I give instructions. Here's your plan to jump at least three spots and mail now in the next 30 minutes then plan to mail three times tomorrow because closing day is where you make all your money first thing in the morning then again at midday then with eight hours to go until the close at midnight and i tell them to pump up your bonus mail your people about it and if you're serious mail your unopens again with just four hours to go so i'm telling them i'm sort of setting expectations for what you need to do if you want to move up in this leaderboard okay now we are on September 20th. This is closing day. And I start off closing day with a new updated leaderboard. And it's closing day and the fight has only just begun. This is what it looks like early this morning. And I give the update. Um, you know, Kenny's one sale out of second. Andy and Mike are surging. Vision drops one. Uh, Eben is starting to move up. He's rising from the dead. Um, in, in jumps and then we down there Greg Habstrit, Habstrit jumps five spots uh, so you know absolutely you know just trying to spur the momentum here now this is what I sent um, in the in early afternoon on closing day sales are ramping up we'll hit two million in the next two or three hours the leaderboards going crazy and so I didn't give a full leaderboard but running run, Brendan running away with first dog fight fight for second crazy battle behind them big bunch just behind them so i didn't give like the full blow by blow but i just gave super quick because things are happening fast at this point then i did a clo uh, a webcast on closing day so just to give you some more ammunition to give you something to mail on here's your link for the webcast then we sent this out with uh with about six hours to go a little more than six hours to go just a quick leaderboard update um, brendan for the win aj and mike had moved <laughs> into second which is just amazing they started out down around 20th and he moved up to second um only, kenny's only one sale behind holly's only two behind evan moves up <laughs> and finally moves up to one um, johnson's still mailing and there's a quick update then uh, and that was actually the last email we sent with about six hours to go that was the last email and then the next day then I came out with the final leaderboard so this is the actual the, this is the last one that went out during the uh, during the, when that launch is actually live and then the next morning I put out the final leaderboard where I just thanked everyone um, told them what their prizes were and you know did my best to, to really thank them within this email so there you go 39 emails that was my JV sequence it's about as intense as a JV sequence you will ever see um, you know, the odds are that you could probably do it with a quarter of these number of emails but uh, it just shows you what goes on behind the scenes of a of a big time uh, multi-million dollar launch when it comes to JVs and of course this is all happening in the background no one knows this is going on but this is the launch within the launch to really get your partners all really amped up so they'll mail and they'll mail again and they'll mail again.